I'm a 30 year old young lady. I started singing in the church um, called Forward in Faith and in 2011 we were involved in a project called Free to Worship. That's when my music journey officially started. I was one of the present worshipper team members in the church and when this opportunity came we were approached and I took the opportunity to take part in it and this is when I more or less broke out of my um, comfort zone um, and I think I believe it was 2012 or 13 when I sang my own um, song called Creating Me that was recorded on one of the albums. I believe that was Free to Worship 3. Um, my favourite part about working in this line of work is that you get to meet people, you get to minister, um, you get to do what you love doing because I've always been a lover of music and now that I'm sharing it with the world, um, sharing a message of hope to the rest of the world is what I enjoy really and this is what makes it favourable for me. I'm, I can't see anything that's less favourable. It is a challenge because every time you always say you have to be aware of your surroundings and it requires you to be um, in I think I think you have to be in touch with with your spirituality and I what I mean by that is the Holy Spirit has been has to be part and parcel of wherever you are wherever you're going to minister um, because you do want to touch someone's life and you have to enter that place in the right set mindset I think um, and this is where it starts from Oh, I've got so many memorable moments. Um, last year, I hosted Janet Manuela when I did the Women in Gospel show. I was joined with Jane Loka. I was joined with Rudo Gomba, um, Caroline Rumbi. These are local artists that sing here in the UK. Um, that was the most exciting project that I've done um, as a solo artist. That was exciting. And previously to that, when we initially launched our initial group me and my husband friends in christ that was exciting because this was something that was we didn't think we'll do it and now we look back as a as a memory of things that have sort of come through over the years it's just amazing and it it can't be our doing alone only god has shown himself to us i get inspired by every artists out there um, you're grinding you're doing your thing um, you're ministering you're preaching the word of God so everyone out there grinding doing music because I understand how hard it is you're my inspiration because you are breaking out of your comfort zone um, to spread the word of God and that's what makes you my inspiration um, so many people I look up to Michael Mahendere in Zimbabwe out there and uh, in, in America Kirk Franklin there's a whole lot uh, a whole list of people um, that I, that have made it and I look up to if I could be a fruit which one would it be hmm I like watermelon <laughs> not sure why uh, I just like that it's I guess something that you can get hydrated from it quite quickly because it's what it's a watery fruit so it can quench your thirst quite quickly that's why i like it i've performed at king's arms church which we've done four if not five four gigs there um the ambience there is just amazing and um, the setup is 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 great it's simple and to the point that's why i love going there really and and the people that um that we work with they are just so gentle and loving and that's why i like working with them i have collaborated with others i've done a collaboration with pastor g I've done collaborations with other upcoming artists here who are based here. Um, if I could name a few, Natasha Mangwende, 
this is one of our young youth uh, upcoming artists in the UK I'm open I'm an open book and um, the process is it's different for every person uh, when I worked with the uh, with um, uh, Pastor G it was something that happened by chance not even planned he was there recording his um, uh, music in another room in another studio room and then he came in and then he said um, I believe if I'm correct he said something along the lines of wow this song is amazing this is a very powerful song and I just had the guts to just sort of say to him do you mind just putting a verse or even just doing something to make it more you know to make the track more fuller in 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 the presence of god and he and he i i thought he would say um contracts etc no he just literally got on the mic and did what is what is what is known to do which is minister and this that's one of my favorite tracks um the track is called aripo on um inyasha album um, I know I mentioned Natasha Mangwende. This is someone that has worked on our Friends in Christ album. She then went on to do to be a solo artist after. Um, I've worked with different people um, here and in Zimbabwe. Some may not be known as yet, but I'm sure in due course you get to know their names. My favorite way to unwind after a hard day is taking a nice shower um and having a nice hearty meal and switching on the tv for a few seconds to watch um the news or something like that and um thereby i then go to bed and read my bible there's always room for improvement as a musician i could never say i'm the best um or better um i always strive to to do more i always try to, to, to thrive to do more for the kingdom of god and even vocally i always thrive um, to practice and rehearse learn new skills it's always about research you don't go weary you don't go tired of um of of, of learning and hence why i have an open mind um, the better the bigger you go the better you have to become yourself If I did not become a musician, I would still be a nurse. This is my uh, um, job that I do um, on the on the side. Um, rather, this is my full time job. I'm a registered mental health nurse, and it's probably something that I'll pro continue pursuing until I get to either being a consultant and etc. That's where I think I will be. Well, I'm reachable on all the major online music stores for those interested in getting hold of my music on Deezer, Tidal, um, YouTube, iTunes, Spotify. My music is found there, Amazon, etc. You can find it just even Google Cheryl Manatza. You'll be able to see um, links to my music. Um, in terms of social media, I am on Instagram. You can look for me at Sharon underscore Manatza. Um, Facebook, I've got a Facebook page. Uh, www.facebook.co.uk forward slash Sharon Manatza official. I'm also on Twitter, which is at Manatza underscore Sharon. So, yes. Do hit me up if you want to ask any questions or want to know more about Sharon Manatza. Feel free on those forums. I am there. And for bookings, you can uh, find us um, via email. SharonManatza2 at gmail.com or on 078-55-340-649. That's the number to reach us. And that's a UK number. Plus 44. Or seven eight five five three four zero six four nine. Thank you.